Hey friends, Jackie here from Interact with a quick video showing you how you can use GIFs within your quiz. So here we are on a quiz cover. If you want to change out this image to use a GIF, simply click on it, hit replace image, and here you're able to search for images. So I'm going to type in flowers because that's what relates to this quiz. I'll click search and you can use static images or click on the Giphy option here. Now you can choose your GIF hit save image, and there it appears in your quiz. You can also add GIFs to the quiz questions as a uh, top image here. Again, I'll click on it, replace it. You could, if you have your own GIFs saved or created, upload them right here by clicking the upload tab and then choosing your file. I'll go ahead and search for GIFs again here. And another option is to add GIFs to the specific answers of a quiz question. So again, I'll click on the image, or if there isn't an image there already, simply click on it. And then you don't have to replace the image, you're just gonna be searching for it here. I'll search flowers again. Choose the Giphy tab. Load more if you don't see what you're looking for. Choose the image, and there it goes into the question itself. Last place you can add GIFs on your quiz is to the quiz result page. Again, I'll click the image, replace it. There we go. So you can see that this is cut off a little bit. When you're clicking into the image, if you want to upload your own, all of the recommended dimensions are listed right here. They are slightly different based on the location that you're loading the image within the quiz. So just check those out. And you're able to resize a GIF outside of Interact and then upload it so the full size or image graphic appears in the placeholder. Here's an example of what GIFs would look like when you're using them as the question answers. This is kind of nice because instead of making people read the answers that they want to choose each time, they can relate with the specific images that they're seeing of these animals. Here's what it would look like when you add a GIF as a question image. And here's a solid example of using a, a GIF as your quiz cover photo. You can see how the movement of the GIF might attract someone's attention to the quiz and then encourage them to take it.